If you have an HDMI trouble, and by trouble I mean you've got a message on your TV saying that uh, you've got the HDCP trouble because uh, the certification has not been accepted and the image cannot be sent to the TV. I will take an Apple TV as an example, but that could be a cable box or a PlayStation, a next box or whatever you want. Any kind of device that can send image may require HDCP certification. And HDCP is high bandwidth digital content protection. Before we go further to the solution, we have to understand why this is here. HDCP is made to protect content. Uh, so by example, if a producer uh, sold a movie on the Apple TV, well, they might have some people who, when they play the movie, want to record it on a device and then send it on the internet. Yes, there is people who are doing this. So the HDCP job is to make their job more complicated. Unfortunately, maybe that's your case. You don't want to do anything that violate the right of some of someone on content. You just want to connect your Apple TV into your uh, home theater system and then on your TV. But uh, the thing with HDCP is that it evolves every year and well, sometime when you connect a new device in an older device, well, the HDCP certification is too old and is not detected as right. So the device cannot send the image if the certification is not verified. So you buy an Apple TV, you buy a home theater, you buy a TV and you cannot watch a movie because of HDCP. So there is two solutions. Well, first one, you don't use HDMI, so that means you use component, but that will reduce a lot your image quality. Or you use a device like this one. This is actually an audio extractor. It, it's not a HDCP bypass, but it kind of do so. So that means you input the HDMI cable here and it output HDMI, so image and sound, and it also output the sound on optical cable and or RCA. But this device got uh, HDCP certification, so when you connect, by example, the Apple TV into it, well, uh, the certification is passed. So you got Apple TV, this, so it get the HDCP certification right, and then it reproduced the image, to the HDMI out without HDCP certification. So you're good to go for the rest. So you can go in whatever device you want. The HDCP is passed and you're good to go. Be careful, not all those kind of device do that. This one actually do. And I will leave you a link in the description if you want this to solve your problem. So this is it. Thank you for watching. I hope it helps. If yes, please make a thumbs up. If you have any questions, please ask in the comment below. I may simply answer you or even maybe make a video just for you. So don't forget to subscribe. And what you do see back there is from my main channel. So please come take a look at this right there. Thank you for watching again. See ya.